if you're trying to be authentic, you're an idiot, okay? Um, you're an idiot, and authenticity is dead, and so is dead, and I want to talk about why, if you're trying to be authentic, you're retarded, and I'm sorry, but that's the truth, okay? And if you want to be not retarded and be a genius, then listen up. So here's the deal. The definition of authenticity, I've got it pulled up here. I know you can't see it, but I'll read it to you. Authentic, adjective, one, of undisputed origin, genuine, in quotations below. Um, the letter is now accepted as an authentic document. Or number two, music of church mode, composed in the notes, relying at it. We don't cover that one, okay? But essentially, authentic means being actually and exactly what is claimed. And so here's the thing, is you trying to be authentic fundamentally isn't authentic. Isn't like, that is not authenticity. And that's fun. Like you trying to be authentic fundamentally is wrong because here's the thing. Authenticity isn't something you try to be. It's something you just do. It's who you are. Like authenticity is just you. Like if you're like if you're trying to be authentically authentically yourself, and so trying to be authentic fundamentally already doesn't understand what authenticity is in the first place, and that is to be exactly and actually what is claimed. Which is if you're trying to be authentic, you're trying to be like you're trying to show people who you are, right? Without hiding things, which means you should just be you. And so here's the thing. If you want to be authentic, you have to just be unapologetically you for who you are, the things you believe in, the things you do, the clothes you wear, like the fucking pajamas I wear every single day while I work, and everything else, okay? Because that's authenticity. Like, here's the thing that people, like, I think miss out on, is they try and find out how to be authentic so people can like them. But that's not authenticity, and that's not right either, because if you, if you want people to really like you, you have to be authentically yourself, and then... People, some people hate you and some will love you, but that's how you build raving fans and loyal following and make a bunch of money, right? You don't make a lot of money by having some people kind of like you. You make a lot of money by having a small portion of the population fucking love you to the point where they'd give you a lot of money. That's how it works, right? So authenticity is dead because people don't know what authenticity is. And so if you want to be authentic, you have to start being you and like, I mean that if someone were to like live with you, there would be no difference in how you present yourselves and present yourself and claim yourself to be than how it would be if they were to live with you because that's who you are. And like you shouldn't feel scared to say anything like for example your political views or whatever the fuck because that's just authentically who you are. Now granted, maybe like in business you don't need to talk politics like who's who gives a fuck, right? But like the point is that if you're trying to be authentic, like you just have to be you. And then, oh, but, but, but Stefan, but I'm weird and, and, and this, and won't that turn people away? Yeah, it will. As a matter of fact, it will turn people away. But like, that's actually the point. Like, we don't make money by having people like, kind of like us. Like, no, like, I'll tell you this, you don't date a girl by having the girl kind of like you. No, you date a girl by having her fucking fall in love with you. Like, that's how, you know what I mean? That's how it works. As a matter of fact, we all probably know that one guy who's friends with everybody, but he has no real good friends. He's just like kind of friends with everybody, but he has no real solid friends. Sucks, doesn't it? Right? And it's the same in, in business. Like we all know that one guy that like, you know, everybody kind of kind of likes him, but nobody buys from him. Right? And it's because people just kind of like him. And the problem is people don't buy from people they kind of like. People buy from people they fucking love. And people that can like absolutely solve the problem they have. Like that's, the kind of people that people buy from. The kind of people that people buy from. Yeah. So, if you want to be more authentic, you just have to be you for who you are without hiding anything or shaming anything. Okay? Like the fact that I'm actually bald. <laughs> I'm just Can you imagine I took my hat off and I was bald? That'd be crazy. Okay? But yeah. Be you for who you are. Here's the crazy part. Fundamentally, every single business is the same. Like technically speaking, right? Like yes... Some businesses, or not in every business, but some businesses are different. But, you know, some businesses may do things quicker, better, faster, etc. But, like, on a core level, a lot of businesses are the same. Even, like, realtors. Fundamentally, every realtor is the same. What separates them is who they are. That's the thing they have going for them, right? There is thousands of companies that sell shoes. Why does Nike make the most money? It's their brand. It's who they are, right? It's that simple. 
literally is like it's it's just that simple like fundamentally the shoes nike makes is made in the same factory as thousands of other shoe distributors same material same everything so why can nike charge way more it's the brand that's associated with it right and that's by them just being who they are wow craziness hope you learned something <laughs> peace